I don't know how other people like learn how to have sex. Like, are people born with it? Like, were you born with the knowledge of how to have sex? Is it? Was anybody born knowing? That's got to be a lie. There's so many of us. <laughs> you have a mustache. You probably have sex. <laughs> Where did you learn? That not that weird? This is like research for someone. Not me. I don't do science. <laughs> so during my freshman year, winter break, college, and we were sitting around the Christmas Eve dinner table, and my sister nonchalantly asked me, so are you dating anybody? And I could not contain my excitement. And without further need for more opportunity, I yelled, I'm in love. <laughs> and I gushed to my parents, my sister and my sister's new boyfriend, now ex-boyfriend Andrew, about the love of my life. <laughs> and my sister was really, really excited for me. And my sister's boyfriend, now ex-boyfriend Andrew, he gave me a look. And from that look, I knew that he knew that I knew little, if not nothing, about lesbian sex. <laughs> I realized that this might be my only chance to learn. And he thought that being my sister's boyfriend at the moment, it was his responsibility to teach me. <laughs> I, uh, I don't want there to be any confusion in the story of like who the weirdo is, right? Like I didn't <laughs> want this. <laughs> like in my, in my perfect reality, like I would not learn, to learn how to have lesbian sex by my sister's boyfriend. So I sat down next to the Christmas tree and Andrew told me how to have sex with a woman, <laughs> where to go and how to get there <laughs> and what to do once I got there and how often to go back there. And as he told me how to have sex, as he went into explicit detail about what he did, I did everything I could to separate the girl he was doing it to and the fact that that was my sister. 